Hello everyone, here I am Dr. Bibi Kumar going to give uh, another lecture on how you will do the uh, correlation analysis on Excel sheet and how you can draw regression line. I think you may all know how to open the Excel sheet. Here I have taken the two uh, variable x and y and uh, x variable is 9 and y is also and y is uh, dependent on the x. So first of all you have to conf confirm that your uh, toolbar is showing this icon, data analysis icon or not and if it is not showing then you can go simply here and you will have here the excel options so you you have to go here the uh, eight inks and you have to confirm that here you can see that the analysis tools pack is here so click here and then go okay so you will find this icon here when you will find this icon so simply you click here then uh, in that you will uh, find that uh, different uh, uh, options of analysis tool so here i have i am going to do the correlation so here i will choose the correlation and then we will do the ok option so here it will ask the what is your input range so first here you will click and then uh, you have to select this x and y and again you have to uh, click here and then you have to do uh, confirm that you want to do the column based uh, correlation as analysis or row based so here my purpose is to do the column based analysis so i will click here on column and uh, did i uh, do you want to label this x and y should visible on that the uh, in table so if it is so that you click here and it will ask the what is your where you want to your output range so output range here you have to click and then again here you have to go suppose i have chosen the in, uh, output range here so this is a selected and now uh, you can uh, do the okay so here what you find that x and y x and x is the perfectly correlated and x is uh, x having relationship with y is positively uh, 0.86 means correlation is of 0.86 so it is the correlation in between the x and y means y uh, is depend uh, is having uh, the correlation with x is about uh, 0.86 so if you are interested to do the uh, to draw a regression line so you can draw a regression line of this also so simply you go here in insert and here you will find the scatter uh, diagram is here so you select first of all the here this and uh, now you simply put on here then you will find that the here the option of scatter diagram so put here and you will find the scatter diagram so this scatter diagram is indicating that this is having a positive correlation so here my basic purpose is to draw the regression line so for doing this you have to go in the here layout and here you will find a trend line in trend line you have to draw the linear trend line so i will click here so this i got linear trend line a line is uh, will be drawn here but i have to do something more for the more analysis so i have to go for the more trend line option so here i find that different type of the option my basic purpose is to do draw the linear because correlation is always a linear and i have some other uh, uh, output like display equation should be all on there and r value square all value should be there so here i got the equation so here this is the equation of um, regression line so it uh, from here you can very easily uh, draw this what is the what would be the y means output when the x will change suppose you if you are fitting this any value here then you will find this y value and this is the r square correlation and it is its value is here we can see that 0.74 it means that this uh, uh, independent this means this value x is having 74 percent contribution on this y means because of this it is 74 percent near about 74 percent is confirmed that the changes occur in y is because of this your x and i hope you uh, you understand it and you can 
easily learn from this and you enjoy it too and if you enjoy it, then you can subscribe for uh, subscribe here for uh, dr bin kumar for more information in the future thank you all for listening my